What this tutorial is about is analyzing data using a trend line. Uh, we have data here from the uh, Leonardo da Vinci lab where we measured the radius of a, a radius bone in a person's arm versus the person's height. The first thing we want to do is create a scatter plot. To create a scatter plot in Microsoft Excel, this is Microsoft Excel 2007, we highlight the entire columns including the uh, titles and the data. We then go to insert and then we pick scatter and choose the first scatter plot which is called an XY scatter and there we have our scatter plot. Drag it over here. We'll make it a little bit bigger so we can see what's going on. You can edit the title by simply double clicking on it and we could call this radius versus height and we can also label the axes so if we simply double click on the x-axis you'll see that the menus at the top change we click on layout and over here is axis title we simply click on that we say primary uh, horizontal axis title title below axis and this is our uh, radius bone and we did that in inches and I'll just put parentheses, uh, parentheses in inches we can also label the vertical axis by simply double clicking on that, picking layout at the top, going to axis title and picking primary vertical axis title and we'll make the title vertical and this time we'll call this one the height in inches. Let's highlight it. A nice little trick you to get in there. Height parentheses in inches. And we'll make this a little bit longer so that our vertical uh, title will be readable. And there it is, height in inches. And that is how we create a scatter plot uh, in Microsoft Excel.